<laughs> Welcome back to River City Live. UF Health has added some new technology that has taken the rehabilitation, rehabilitation game to a whole nother level. We have about 45 minutes of direct care with each patient. So we have a licensed professional, a physical therapist, occupational therapist, speech therapist. Um, we have a couple of physical therapist assistants, but they're all licensed personnel that spend that dedicated 45 minutes of one-on-one -on -one time with our patients. That is Scott Fortner speaking about one of the traits that makes UF Health Rehab special. At some facilities, patients do not receive such focused attention from licensed practitioners. UF Health also has the largest concentration of McKinsey or MDT certified therapists in the area. I'll let him explain. That's a philosophy of care that's focused on um, patient education, patient involvement and empowerment, and it uses a very simple home exercise program of postural change and very simple exercise that the patient learns and controls themselves. And it's shown to be very effective in low back pain, neck pain, it's mo most associated with the people who have back or spine pain. Good to know, by the way. Of the 10 MDT certified therapists within 100 miles of Jacksonville, eight are at UF Health. But I really want you to know about that space age technology. First up. At this facility, we have the Alter G, which is a, um, a treadmill that uses an air bladder underneath that unweights the patient. It reduces the load on the lower extremity. So any patient who has ankle, hip, knee, arthritis or pain in those joints or might have a fracture and have has a restriction in how much weight they can bear, those patients will actually be able to be mobile in, in a less weighted environment. So less pain, less impact on the joints, and uh, it's fairly unique. There are a few of these around Jacksonville, but this latest model offers camera views to allow therapists to monitor patient gait, etc. Next, uh, we have our vector system here in the neuro rehab area. The vector system is um, very unique in terms of it it's, uses a harness system and an overhead cam, and the cam um, can help modulate the person's forward or backward speed. You can adjust the tension on the, uh, the harness system so that when you're gait training a patient or you're helping someone learn how to walk again or helping rehabilitate someone who has a balance problem, for instance, that the, the that system will slow down their descent. If they lose their balance, they're not going to fall, that, but they actually may go well outside of their um, their center of gravity and so they can be given the opportunity to correct themselves. This allows patients to correct themselves which helps speed up their recovery and it is the only one in Jacksonville. Next. We also have the FES bike which is for patients who have either hemiparesis, one-sided weakness or total denervation of their muscles. It actually allows their body to um, to the electricity um, coming through the pads that are attached to specific muscle groups has the patient move through an upper body or lower body uh, movement like a bicycle and it allows them to get improved circulation and um, flexibility and act actually allows them to use their joints and muscles like they would if they were able. Uh, the thought behind this is if um, we continue to work with them and they get neuro recovery or n return of that neurological function, you won't have wasting in those muscles, you won't have atrophy of those muscles and the person will be able to resume function faster than if they hadn't had that treatment. I'm Rance Adams for River City Live. Scott and his team are proud to have a, such a large number of board certified therapists and a roster of academics doing research to further enhance and speed up patient recovery. You can find out more information at ufhealth.org.